say. We've got many generations here. Goodbye to his mama as he left South Dakota to fight for the red, white, and blue. He was 19 and green with a new M16, just doing what he had to do. He was dropped in the jungle where the choppers would rumble with the smell of me palm in the air. And the sergeant said, look up. Ahead. Like a dark evil cloud, 1,200 came down on him and 20 men more. They fought for their lives and most of them died in the 173rd Airborne. On the 8th of November, the angels were crying as they carried his brothers away. With the fire raining down and the hell all around, there were few men left standing that day. Saw an eagle fly through a clear blue sky in 1965. The 8th of November. He's 58 and his ponytail's gray, but the battle still plays in his head. He limps when he walks, but he's strong when he talks about the shrapnel they left in his leg. He puts on a suit over his airborne tattoo and he ties it on one time a year. He remembers one and he swallows it down with his tears. On the 8th of November, the angels were crying as they carried his brothers away. When the fire raining down and the hell all around, there were few men left standing that day. Saw an eagle fly through a clear blue sky, 1965, November. November, the angels were crying as they carried his brothers away. With the fire raining down in the hell all around, there were few men left standing that day. Saw the eagle fly through a clear blue sky, 1965. The 8th of November. So goodbye to his mama as they left South Dakota to fight for the red, white, and blue. He was 19 and green with a new M16, just doing what he had to do. Thank you. Very sad song, but very proud of those days.